Hi students, today I'll be discussing about operations on functions. Under operations on functions, we have addition, subtraction, multiplication, division, and also compositions of functions. But now, let us discuss first about addition and subtraction of function. Before we proceed, let us know first the objectives. Objectives, first, the learner is able to perform addition and subtraction of functions. Second, the learner is able to evaluate the sum and difference of function. And lastly, the learner is able to solve problems involving function. Let's proceed. Addition and subtraction of function. For the definition, let f and g be functions. In addition, their sum, denoted by f plus t, is the function defined by f plus g of x is equals to f of x plus g of x. So, when you see this notation, it is equals to f of x plus g of x. And in subtraction, their difference, denoted by f minus g, is function defined by f of g, f minus g of x is equals to f of x minus g of x. So, let us have examples. Given the functions, f of x equals x plus 3, p of x equals 2x minus 7, g of x equals x squared plus 2x minus 8, v of x equals x squared plus 5x plus 4. Using these functions, let us solve these problems, which is number 1, v plus g of x f plus p of 2, p minus f of x, and then g minus v of 4. To solve, for example number 1, here, find v plus g of x if v of x is equals x squared plus 5x plus 4, and g of x equals x squared plus 2x minus for the solution, v plus g of x is equals to v of x plus g of x. Okay, since this is the given, for v of x, we, are, we just simply substitute the given function x squared plus 5x plus 4. And for gx, x squared plus 2x minus 8. Since the operation is addition, so we just simply combine like terms. So, x squared plus x squared is 2x squared and 5x plus 2x it is 7x and then positive 4 plus negative 8 is negative 4. So, that's why this is the final answer of B, v plus g of x equals 2x squared plus 7x minus 4. Let us find out more examples. For example, number 2. Find f plus p of 2 if f of x equals to x plus 3 and p of x is equals to 2x minus 7. As you can see, we have here the value of x. This is what you called evaluating the sum of a function. We do not stop alone in just adding functions. So, we have to evaluate it. So, here, we have two available or we have two case to solve this. First is this. So, f plus p of x is equals f of x plus p of x. So, we just simply substitute the given function for f of x which is x plus 3 and then for p of x is 2x minus 7 and then add or combine combining like terms 3x plus 2x is 3x and then positive 3 plus negative 7 it is negative 4 so since 
we have the value of 2 we have to evaluate this given so which is p plus p sub p f plus p of 2 is equals to 3 times 2 minus 4 so we just simply substitute the value of 2 to x so that's why it will become 3 times 2 minus 4 so the answer is f plus p of 2 is equals to 2 so this is the fi final answer okay for the solution number 2 so here f plus p of 2 equals f of 2 plus p of 2 so we just simply substitute the given function and the given uh, value to evaluate which is 2 plus 3 plus 2 times 2 minus 7 so we just sim simplify 2 plus 3 it is 5 2 times 2 it is 4 minus 7 I'll bring down 7 okay 5 plus 4 9 then minus 7 so that's why the final answer is 2 so uh, any solution so it will get the same result which is f plus p of 2 is equals 2 okay so for our example number 3 so this time it is find p minus f of x if p of x is equals to 2x minus 7 and f of x equals x plus 3 so this time the operation is subtraction we have to move we have to subtract the function of p we have to subtract the function the function of p and the function of f so here so for the solution p minus f of x is equals to we have we just simply substitute or we just simply put the given function so for px p of x it is 2x minus 7 and then for f of x it is x plus 3 since the operation is subtractions so all the subtrahend will change the sign so that's why it will become 2x minus 7 then minus x minus 3 and simplify simplify or combining like terms 2x minus x it is x then negative 7 minus negative 3 it is negative 10 okay so the final answer is of p minus f of x is equals to x minus 10 number four find v minus g of 4 if v of x is equals to x squared plus v plus 5x plus 4 and g of x equals to x squared plus 2x minus 8 so this time the operation is subtraction and then at the same time we have to evaluate this so this is what you call evaluating of the difference of the function okay to solve v minus g of x is, is equals to v of x minus g of x so we will get the given for v of x which is x squared plus 5x plus 4 and then for g of x which is x squared plus 2x minus 8 so since the given is subtraction or the operation so we have to copy the minuend which is x squared plus 5x plus 4 and then we will change the sign of the subtrahend so that's why it will become minus x squared minus 2x plus 8 and then combining like terms so that's why so this is just repeat repeated so as you can see they are just the same so x squared combining like terms x squared minus x squared so this is cancel and then 5x minus 2x is equals to 3x and then 4 plus 8 is 12 but we are not end of we are not end in this situation so we have to evaluate this because the value of x is given so v minus x of 4 is equals to 3 times 4 plus 12 
we just substitute the value of x which is 4 so, and then next is 3 times 4 12 plus 12 so that's why the answer is 24 so for v minus g of 4 is equals to 24 so now let us proceed to the second solution for this problem so here with the same problem for the solution number 2 so v minus g of 4 equals v of 4 minus g of 4 so now here we will put already the value of x okay so since the given for v of x is x squared that's 5x plus 4 we will put already the value of 4 which is 4 raised to 2 plus 5 times 4 plus 4 and then, and then same with g of x which is x squared that's 2x minus 8 we will substitute the value of x which is 4 which is 4 raised to 2 plus 2 times 4 minus 8 so since the operation is subtractions subtraction so we will just simply copy this or simplify this minuend which is 4 times 2 or 4 raised to 2 is 16 5 times 4 20 and then 4 is bring down so since this is the subtrahend we will we will change all the signs so since 4 raised to 2 is 16 and this is positive so that's why it will become negative which is minus 16 and then 2 times 4 8 since this is positive it will become negative 8 and then since negative 8 it will become positive 8 now we will simply we can now simplify this 16 plus 20 36 plus 4 it is 40 minus 16 24 minus 8 16 and then plus 8 so that's why it will become 24 so for the final answer it is v minus g v minus g of 4 is equals to 24 so as you can see the answer is same with our first solution 24 also so that's it that's it class so i hope you understand how to add and subtract the function so i hope you like it don't forget to like this video thanks